as Montserrat is to designers, you are just my type. Your beauty needs no saturation. You are naturally color graded. Forget Pinterest. You are my source of inspiration. Oh my God! Wow! What if graphic designers are asked to give pickup lines? Just, just think about it. So recently, when I was scrolling through Twitter, I came across this post that said that designers pick up lines. Let's have it. And I paused for a while, and I was like. This is going to be interesting. Just imagine graphic designers giving pickup lines. I mean, who would think of it that way? So I went through the comments and it was so interesting. And so I decided to share a couple of them with you and maybe we can pick something out of it. So let's get into the video. Hey everybody innocent here and welcome to the channel. Over here, we, of course, we'll be doing more of this going forward. So if you are interested in something like this, you may consider subscribing. So first off, I want to say that this wasn't entirely my idea. The guy that posted this is Clement Blessing on Twitter. And I just went through the comments to see pickup lines that graphic designers or designers in general would just come up with. So let's take a look at some of them. So let's kick it off with the author of the post and his pickup line was this. You are like the perfect mock-up. Everything just falls into place when you're around. Really? Bro! Now, this is an awesome line. You see how as graphic designers, we try to use mock-up to make every... Recently, I heard someone saying that mock-ups makes every, almost even any ugly design beautiful. Okay, so this is this line in particular is literally telling us how mockups make designs beautiful and of course if you're a designer out there and you are not using or you're not utilizing mockups to present your works you are missing out on that because blessing is basically telling us that mockups makes everything fall into place now i'm going to save this and i'm going to use it out now the next one is coming from olasinde at uh, sorry i i can't really be mentioning the names but then i'll put it somewhere around here he says that your beauty needs no saturation. You are naturally color graded. Nice. Bro, I never knew graphic designers could be this romantic and they could have this in our phrase. Man. So I think this line is a bit self-explanatory because you all basically know what saturation does. It is used to intensify colors or add more life to colors in your designs okay so this line is basically saying that your beauty needs no saturation which literally means that your beauty needs no extra color or extra intensity okay you are naturally color graded so you don't need to add any form of color to you or you don't need to intensify the colors in your beauty this is a brilliant one now the same person came up with this one forget pinterest you are my source of inspiration I mean, what? You see, okay, so first off, Pinterest, almost every designer has been to Pinterest before. I think that can be agreed upon. So we all go to Pinterest for inspiration. And this guy right over here is saying that forget Pinterest. You, 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 you are my source of inspiration. So we are no more going to Pinterest for inspiration again. If you need inspiration for your designs, Go to your wife, go to your girlfriend. <laughs> now, the next one, it says that why go into free pick when you have all the assets I need? Oh my God! I wow. need people. <laughs> okay, so a bit of contest. Free pick is more or less like Pinterest where you can get assets, different type of assets and inspiration, templates, brushes, so many things. I mean, general graphic design, Asset. Okay, so you literally go to free pick for asset. Now this guy right over here is saying that why go into free pick when you have all the assets that I need? I mean, how do you guys come up with this? So he's no more going into free pick for assets again. He's basically just you know getting all the assets he needs from that one special person. I think this is also a great one. Now, Fash typed a couple of them, but I think this one really caught my attention. As Montserrat is to designers, you are just my type. 
I mean, the correlation over here. Okay, so first of all, Mozart is a font, a typeface or a font, a type of font. Okay, and then he say that as Mozart, many designers uses Mozart. I, I mean, I've been using Mozart over and over again, and I know many designers also uses Mozart a lot. And he's saying that as Mozart is to designers, you are just my type. And the type here is referring to the font as in a type, a typeface. Wait a minute! Who are you? Now, that is a great one. Seriously, like, I'm not going to lie. Now, the next one here, the phenomenal designer, he says that you are my Montserrat and Poppins. I can't do without you. <laughs> now, I can personally relate to this a lot. And if you've been a subscriber on this channel for a while, you can also relate to this because on this channel, we mostly use poppins, okay? And like I explained earlier, many people, many designers also use this Montserrat a lot. And this bar is, or this punchline, pickup line is saying that you are my Montserrat and poppins. I mean, you are something or you are a typeface, a font that I would normally use as a designer. I can't do without you. Many people have been saying that I can't do a design without poppings, which partially is true and confirms this a lot. So this person right there is saying that they can't, you know, do without you. Just like you can't make a design without poppings or Montserrat, they can't do without you. They can't go a day without you. They can't go a week without you or hours, minutes, seconds. Now, the next one says that, are you a font? Because you are looking bold and beautiful. Man, I think your graphic designers need to be really researched because, uh, you know, most graphic designers are introverted and sometimes when you see them, you won't even believe that they could talk or they speak, actually. But you people dropping these punch pickup lines, man. Give you me a good old rub, 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 rub. <laughs> boy, <I'll be. laughs> now, the next one is coming from Ajay Solomon. You are my palette. Be the color of my life. So basically, a palette is like a range of colors um, that artists or graphic designers can choose from. So this person is saying that you are my palette. So you are coming to color my life. I would have different colors that I can choose from you. You see, this, this is brilliant, you know. For you to be able to craft this, it is brilliant, honestly. So these are some of the comments that people give out in the comment section and I think they are brilliant. You could learn a couple of things from them. If you could really relate to the pickup lines, trust me, they are, they are so interesting. But then of course, when I saw it, I wouldn't go without giving mine. Okay, so here is mine. Are you the liquefied too? Cause my heart melts every time I see you. What do you guys think? So basically, the liquify tool in Photoshop, it works similar to the blur tool. It just basically transforms or converts solid things into kind of liquid. You see the name liquify, okay? So when you pick the liquify tool and you brush it over your face, you realize that the solid thing or the solid face is kind of turning into a liquid or liquefied or it is liquefying it. You get a point. So this bar right over here is saying that are you the liquefied too? Because my heart melts every time I see you. When you have the heart and then you apply the liquefied tool on it, it is basically going to melt. So these are some of the awesome pickup lines that I read from Twitter. And I'm glad I could share this with you. What are your thoughts about this? I think this is a great way of learning. If you could understand some of these things, you realize that if you really don't understand your game, your graphic design game well, Sometimes you won't even be able to craft some of these things. So yeah, leave your pickup line as a graphic designer in the comment section. And if there is any of the lines that you didn't understand too, let me know in the comment section. Or if you want to throw more light on any of the lines, let me know in the comment section and let's get interactive over there. So yeah, that will be basically it for this video. Let me know if you are interested in more of such videos and don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video. It's Innocent here and bye!